What's up, guys? It's me, QuickGG, back here again with my good friend, Chill and Play. How you doing, pal? I'm doing great, big dog. Just got these brand new shoes. Feeling fresh out here. Got the flame pants on. I'm uh looking good. Feeling great. That is pretty fresh. I'm not gonna lie. Well, anyway, welcome in, guys. If you guys don't know what's going on, me and my friend Chill and Play make teams of Pokemon with a challenge involved, and then we battle. And for today, we're on Scarlet and Violet, and what we're actually gonna be doing is taking an idea, actually, somebody said in one of my live streams, which is to actually go over randomized starting Pokemon and tell each other what kind of job they would have and with that information alone we're going to choose our random starters so for an example i'm going to toss out this one right here as you guys see we got an ursa ring over here and i would say maybe something an ursa ring could do would be a bouncer or maybe even a bodyguard because i mean it looks kind of tough it looks like it's ready to fight for the team you know and it's sleeping now terrible worker honestly but anyway once we have our teams together we're going to go ahead and make competitive move sets and then battle it out chill and play are you ready for this the uh Pokemon workers challenge. Yeah, man. Uh, let me stretch it out. I guess I'm ready. Uh, Charizard, come on. Let's go. Let's get active. All right, let's do this. All right, chill and play. I got your first set of starting Pokemon right here in front of me. I hope you're ready to hear these jobs. Let's take a look. Oh, man, buddy. We got some employees here. Elite employees? You are now one of my elite employees. Um, no, none of these are my elite employee. But anyway, let's go ahead and start with their jobs. On the left, this would be a grape stopper or a grape treader. You know, those people that that stomp on grapes for wine. Okay, a lot yeah, of yeah, Pokemon yeah. could do that. All right, so okay. it's got feet. All right. In the middle, this could be a sound effects artist, you know, so something that makes a lot of sounds and sound effects. Ooh, okay, okay. And on the right, this would be a meditation instructor, you know, somebody to guide you on your meditations. Do I get any points for guessing something? You will get it one cool point per correct guess for this challenge, yeah. Okay, that is amazing, actually. Okay, okay, is the middle one the sound effect artist? Is that an exploud, maybe? No, no. No, it's not. Good guess. Okay. Let's take the Grape Stomper. He sounds heavy. Grape Stomper. I mean, that's a good one. That was a really good one. You missed yourself a Chimecho, you know, meditation instructor. You missed yourself oh. a Squawkabilly. That thing be squawking. You know what oh, I mean? No. Making a lot of noises. Yeah. We are good on those. Yeah. And you got yourself an Executor, you know? He's oh. just got the feats. Okay. Okay. But it looks like you could use him to stomp around. If you need something to stomp on stuff, that's about as good as he's going right. to be for you guys. <laughs> You're <an> right. <laughs> that is pretty good. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's your Executor. All right, here we go, buddy. We got your first set of three. Let's take a look at them first. Oh, wow. Three employees. Let's talk about them. On the right here, we've got a Pokemon that could be an agriculture assistant. Agricultural assistant. That's right. That's right. In the middle, okay. we've got Lazy River Maintenance. <laughs> Maintenance? Maintenance. And then on the left, we've got an underwater exploration assistant. Oh, we got some watery ones. Some helpers. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed that, but they're all assistants. Nothing sounds too great. Agricultural assistant, you said? Yep, yep. So, like, agricultural assistant in what kind of way? Like a, like a, like a farming type way, agricultural assistant? Um, you know, it could assist with pest control, uh, crop cultivation, ensuring healthy plant growth, etc. Okay. I'm gonna take the lazy river maintenance. <laughs> Okay. All right. That's a Politoed. Oh, nice, buddy. It uses okay. his control of water flow to maintain currents for a relaxing flow of water at the local water park. That's what you get, buddy. Politoed. Wow. Wow, Politoed. I'll take that. That's honestly not bad at all. He's so happy to see you. What did I miss? What did I miss? Oh, you missed a Basculin. That is a uh, underwater exploration assistant. And then you mm -hmm. missed a Venusaur. Agriculture Venusaur? tasks, buddy. Plant, grow, poison the, uh, the bad stuff. It can do it all. Agricultural assistant Venusaur. Or you, you couldn't say like a stink bomb person? No, he's not no. stinky. <laughs> Oh, I can smell. It smells great. It smells great. Okay. All right. It smells great. Okay. Yeah, I'll take I'll take a Politoed, though. That's pretty decent. All right, chill and play. Time for the second set of starting Pokemon. Let's see what these workers are doing. And whoa, they're working, buddy. I'm working here. On the left, this Pokemon would be an underwater tour guide. Oh, okay. In the middle, this Pokemon could be a search and rescue lifeguard, maybe slash coast guard. Ooh, a brave fish. On the right, this Pokemon would be an archaeologist. Okay, that's pretty cool. Cool. Makes me think it's maybe some type of bone for some reason. You know what, though? When you say an underwater tour guide, I personally think of the Mr. Manta Ray from uh, Finding Nemo. He's a large, uh, you know, a large tour guide. Very powerful com compared to the local fish, you know? He can protect you. He can give you a ride. Okay. 
Makes me want to believe it's a Kyogre. So let me take that tour guide. Please be a Kyogre that we can ride on the back of it. Well, let me let me start off with what you missed. You missed an archaeologist, uh, a Sandaconda, you know, because okay. it's just all up in the ground. You know, I mean, I feel like it could do some archaeology for the team. Search. I would have said an orange squeezer, but okay, for like, you know, squeeze for orange juice. It's a snake. Okay, it could be an orange squeezer. You're right. That's, that's, I, you know, out of pocket. I like it. The middle one was a uh, Coast Guard, you know, search and rescue, maybe lifeguard. That would be a Swana. You know what I mean? Just. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Aerial, you know, aerial views. In yeah. case you. Uh, got swept away in the ocean, you know, Swan is coming looking for you to help. You got yourself a underwater tour guide, Luminian. Uh, yeah, big fish that sits at the bottom of the floor and uh, it kind of knows its way around, you know? It's still pretty good. I mean, it's still pretty good. Ah, uh, Luminian's decent. Not a Kyogre, but it's a Pokemon. We'll take it. I probably wouldn't assign Kyogre that job, but, uh, you know, I, I, I respect it. I respect the idea of anyone could be a tour guide. All right, let's take a peek at your next set here and see what we got. We've got three different workers here. What could they do, I wonder? Maybe they're taxi drivers? Maybe, maybe. Hey, let's talk about it. This one on the left happens to be a really good late night security guard. Oh, okay, interesting. Lycanroc, that's just a guess. <laughs> In the middle, you've got a hypnotherapist. Hypnosis therapist, you could say. <laughs> and then on the right, you've got a metal worker. Ah, oh, metal worker. What could that be? What could what could they be? Okay, okay. I'm just gonna guess all three and tell me if I'm close to any of them. I don't want to tell you though. You don't have to tell me. I'm just gonna guess okay, for the sake okay. of guessing. Let the, the homies will know if you're right. Lycanroc, Drowsy, I'm mean, no hypno, girder. Those are my three guesses. Okay, solid guesses, solid guesses. What are you taking though? Give me the, the hypnotizer. I want that one. Well, you could have had a lichen rock. You did guess that one right. No way I got that right. That's crazy that I got that right. <laughs> yeah, dude, post a lichen rock up at your house at night and you'll be fine. They can see great distances in the dark. They're fierce. That's crazy I got that. That's funny. Yep, yep. And the metal worker happened to be a cool lava. It can use okay. its extremely hot lava to obviously bend metals and combine, etc. And then you got yourself a poly whirl. Oh, oh my gosh. It's got the hypnosis ring in the middle. Don't I have poly toad already? You do, but now you got a poly wrath, buddy. Double the polys. I got two polys? That's right. I got poly polys? Yep. You got poly Pokemons, buddy. Congratulations. That's kind of crazy. That's honestly kind of crazy. I love it. All right, chill and play. Time for set number three of your starting Pokemon. Let's take a look-see and whoa, we got Pokemon here. All right, let's start off on the right over here. This Pokemon, hmm, this Pokemon could be a Safari Guide. Okay, okay. All right, in the middle, this Pokemon could be a professional surfer. And on the left, this Pokemon could be... A blacksmith. Goldango, professional surfer. Surf's up, dude. Let me get that. You want the surfer? Okay, well, you missed out on a fairy giraffe, you know, professional, uh, I mean, a safari guide, you know, basically it knows the lands. It knows, it knows how to safari. A rigoraf, you mean? Fairy giraffe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever you want to call it. Okay. You missed a perserker. It would have been a blacksmith. And you got yourself a professional surfer. You really chose that very fast and it's not Goldingo. Any other guesses? What? Uh, Sharpedo? Professional surfer? It's a lowland Raichu, buddy. Oh He's surfing on his gosh. own tail. He surfs oh on his gosh. own tail. I should have thought about it longer. <laughs> I thought I knew it immediately. I was like, Goldango in my head. And you just chose blasted. it so fast. You chose it so Sash. fast. And I get it. I get it because they both could be. You're right. But I mean, I've seen, if you've never seen him in Pokemon Snap, he's surfing on his tail the whole time. And he's also standing on his tail right now. Oh yeah, he always is. That's, that's That makes perfect sense to me. Yeah, nice choice there, buddy. We'll take it. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. All right, buddy. Let's see who you're gonna hire today. What kind of job do you need done, I wonder? I need some professionals. We actually might have some here. Let's take a peek. On the right here, we've got a snack mascot. Snack mascot? That's right, that's right. Use your imagination. In the middle, we've got a fitness trainer. All right, okay, I'm down for that. A choke. And on the left, we've got a vehicle. <laughs> a vehicle? <laughs> So we have a taxi. We have a taxi, basically. We have a taxi. Let's go with that, a taxi. Uh, I think that's gonna be Varum, maybe, right? If it's a vehicle, it has to be Varum. It could be the fitness trainer, could be Machoke, and the snack, I don't, I don't, whatever that snack mascot is. Come on, guess the snack mascot. Just think, buddy, hmm. If I had to guess what a snack mascot would be, is it Fletchling? Oh, you just love Fletchling, don't you? <laughs> I'm joking. What are you choosing? What are you choosing? Let me get the fitness trainer. Let me 
Let's 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 work out. Alrighty then. The snack mascot was none other than a squavit, buddy. A little a squirrel, squavit? little adorable little squirrel. Put him on a pack of nuts, uh, a pack of trail mix. You're selling okay. millions. Yeah. Okay, I could see that. And you also missed on a you know a taxi driver here. It's a spectrier. You could hop on this guy and ride for days, buddy. Miles even. A spectrier? Yeah, he's he's already dead, so he doesn't like have to breathe. He can just ride forever. You, you called it a vehicle? It's a horse. You can ride it. A horse is not a vehicle. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> It's not a vehicle. A vehicle is a machine. Yo, this guy is a machine. Have you seen him? He runs forever. <laughs> so every everyone that ride horses are vehicle operators in your opinion. <laughs> you missed a sector, your buddy. You must Sorry. have never rode a horse before, uh, big dog. And you know what? I have one time I, I, rid a, I rode a pony, all right, when I was a youngin. But you got yourself a scraggy fitness trainer. His healthy lifestyle and active uh, state of being makes him a perfect fit for you, buddy. Get fit today. What? He said what? <laughs> Scra do you ever you ever heard of a fitness trainer named Scraggy? Yeah, buddy. Have you seen how Scra lean this guy is, bro? He's also really strong. He's nothing but muscle. Like he has to keep buying new clothes. Like, look, he's having to hold his pants up right now. They're not fitting anymore because he's that oh, in shape, bro. Boy -o. He's that oh, in shape. Boy, oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> We're taking Scraggy. Okay, chill and play starter set number four for you. I hope you're ready to choose. We're looking at some ooh some elite employees. Starting off on the left, this Pokemon could be a geneticist. Oh, whoa. Say, say one more time. A geneticist? A geneticist. This Pokemon in the middle could be a salt farmer. And this Pokemon on the right could be a seismologist. Okay, Seismitoad, Knackle, Stackle, and a Mewtwo. Let's take the Mewtwo. Am I right? You said a geneticist. A geneticist. A geneticist. Well, you missed yourself a Knackle. You missed yourself an Orthworm. I feel like Orthworm could be a seismologist because it literally lives in the ground going through the grounds constantly. Yeah, I guess you're right. I guess you're right. And on the left, you got yourself a Mew. One. Mew. Oh, solid. I was onto it, bro. I feel like Mewtwo, I guess, could also be that, but Mew literally can transform into any other Pokemon. I think it kind of knows how the world works. You know what I'm saying? That's right. That's right. We take that. That's a dub. That's a nice mythic in your pocket, little baby Mew. Okay, pal, three more starters are here, ready to work, ready to get started. What do you want me to tell you about first? We got resumes. Start on the right and go over and make sure they have at least five years of work experience for me, please. Oh, these are all uh, very experienced workers. On the right here, we've got a bulldozer operator. Or just a bulldozer. Bulldozer or bulldoze operator. Okay, so it literally could be anything. Okay. In the middle, we've got an environmental conservationist. Oh, good for them. Good for them. Saving the world. And then finally on the left, we've got an estate guardian. Estate guardian. Why do I feel like you're baiting me with these? No bait here, buddy. All choices. They've all got work experience, buddy. Okay, okay. Estate guardian sounds like something really tough, and I'm gonna pick it, and it's, it's, if it's something <laughs> stupid and terrible, we're just gonna say you're scamming. Give me the estate guardian. Any guessers? Any guessers? Estate guardian? I'm gonna say Golurk. And that's what you wanted? Okay, all right. Thought you'd at least have better hopes. Well, you missed out on a Don fan for the bulldozer slash okay. literally dirt worker in general. Honestly, okay. this guy, he's got extreme control over the dirt. He can make earthquakes, okay. clear it out, whatever he wants to do. You're you missed right. a Drizil. Yeah. Environmental conservationist? A Drizil? It's got an infinite supply of water to spew and make it rain on even the most barren wastelands, big dog. Conserve that environment. Interesting. Do you are you Drizzle like Drizzle like the middle middle stage starter? Gangsta Drizzle! That one, buddy. The middle stage starter? Intellion? Yeah, yeah, you you know him. Environmental conservationist? Drizzil? Okay, okay. Hey, buddy, don't question his job, big dog. He worked hard to get here, okay? Good for them. Yeah, good for them. But you got yourself an estate guardian. Yeah. A bolt hound. Mm. Just kidding. It's a Reshiram. Yeah, that's a Reshiram. You're lying. You, you plop that guy down at your castle. He's a dragon, dude. You know what I'm saying? Let's He's going to take... No one's coming through. No one's getting the treasure. No one's getting in. Everyone's leaving. No one's getting in. That, that's no that's, that's going to guard... A, that's a Fort Knox guardian. I'm taking exactly, it. Exactly, buddy. It's exa and notice I said a state. So you know it's a massive... You know, you know what I'm saying? It's not, a, it's not just a house. Not just a house. It's an estate. Well, there you go. Reshi Ram on the team. <laughs> You're strong. I'm scared. You're very strong right now. Okay, chill and play. This is your fifth option, which means you only have two more choices to take, buddy. And you know what they say about two choices, right? Do you know what they say? You gotta choose one and then be sad about the other you missed out on. They say you have two choices, whether to subscribe or not to subscribe, you know, to the channel. And you have to like the video. That's actually not a choice. And if you don't like the video, then you probably love uh, Pokemon like Scraggy. Dang, he went there. But anyway, let's go ahead and see what Pokemon 
Pokemon you've got here. Buddy, you got choices. I'll just say that. Choices, choices, choices. All right, on the right, you have the Pokemon that could be a Volcano Tour Guide. Volcano Tour Guide, huh? Is it an active volcano? Is it an inactive volcano? A volcano Tour Guide is about the, it's the best I can give you, really. It doesn't matter, you know? It's still a volcano. Okay. In the middle, this definitely would be like an electrician Pokemon. You know, it'd be good for, you know, electrician work. Maybe a Palmy. And on the left, this Pokemon would be a Psychic Reader. Okay, I don't need any more Psychic types. Like, we're done with those. Um, let's take the Electrician, maybe? No, 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 no. Let's think about this. Let's think about it. It might be a Palmot, because those have hands, and those are electric-y. Volcano Tour Guide could be a camera up though. All right, let's go. Let's go with the Electrician. All right, well, you missed the Psychic Reader, Meowstic. Great dodge there. You missed the Volcano Tour Guide, Entei. <sighs> Ouch, 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 ouch. Just give me a second. It's okay. It's okay. Because you got yourself a great electrician. This guy's got all the fingers to work on all the wires. Uh, Regilecki. Regilecki? Oh! Yeah, yeah. Two really good choices here. That is awesome, dude. That is actually really good. Thank you. Thank you for that one. Hey, I didn't choose it. The randomizer chose it. And you chose the electrician. Good choices. All right, Mr. Quick GG. Here we go. Number five for you. We've got three candidates here ready for hire. Looking for work, it would seem. Let's see what their specialty are. On the right here, this Pokemon would be a good emotional support animal. That'd be a good job for him. In the middle, this Pokemon would be a great mind safety monitor. Did you say mind safety? Mind safety. Like in the mines, you know, you know, where you go down into the mines, you go down into the mines and get work done. Oh, mines safety monitor. Okay. And then the final Pokemon here on the left would be a great academic professor. Hmm. I'm thinking right now. I'm in my thinking stance. I feel like Brigbane is the way. Give me Give me, give me the, give me the academic, give me the ac ac academiac, academiac, the academic, the, ac the academian, the my hero academia professor. I don't understand a word you just said. It's just a professor, buddy. Give it to me. Well done, big dog. Well really? done. You got yourself really? a king of the slows. Oh, okay. Yep, yep. Even though he's called a slow king, he happens to be very not slow. In fact, very, very wise. Um, and that's your Pokemon. You missed out on the mind safety inspector. Which was? Or I'm sorry, the mind safety monitor, Roly Coley. It is a uh, literal okay. piece of coal. He could roll around and just check on. He's watching. Yeah, he's just keeping an eye on everything. He could detect gas leaks and ride around, make sure everything's safe. He's small. He could get in those little tight, tight spaces. Mm -hmm. Yep, makes sense. And then your emotional support animal was a little baby rock ruff. He's so cute. He's just a little puppy. Just get you through the day, you know? If you're having a bad day, Go see your rock rough. That sounded adorable, which is why I didn't want to get it. Emotional support animal is not something I want working for me, you know? I'm trying to get real workers, like Slow Kings. Yep, that's a pretty solid one you got there, buddy. All right, you got a professor on the squad. Let's see what the last one's going to be for us. All right, chillin' players, our last set of options here, and I hope you're ready to choose your final employee. On the right, this Pokemon could be a hazardous material specialist. Hmm, sounds mucky. In the middle, this Pokemon could be a dance instructor. And on the left, this Pokemon could be a mouse exterminator. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like it could be some type of cat, like a Raikou. Mm. Um, or other mm. cats. Other cats, too. Other cats. Let's take the Quackaval dance instructor to be safe. Not a Quackaval. It's no! funny because that also would have... That would have worked out pretty well for Quackaval. <laughs> but, uh, you know, this Pokemon is very still most of the time, but when it's moving, it's dancing, buddy. Curlia? It's a thrusty one. Sudowoodoo. No way! Yeah, he yeah, just said... You, no yep, yep, way! Yep. You Dude. know thrusty be dancing. Dancing, bro. Don't even. You know Thrusty. You know he don't dance no more. He don't dance. Thrusty just a, dances. I never want to dance again. He never dances Gen 2, buddy, and you know it. You Well, no, no, you never see him shake his pom-poms and, and, like, pull pull his, like, head back? Never. Never. Buddy, you never, you probably don't play with this Pokemon enough. That's the problem. Don't worry. When it's in your, oh uh, when you're my. reviewing it, you'll see it dancing. Guys, that hurts. That is your final Pokemon, the Thrusty one. The Sudowoodoo. We call him Thrusty, by the way, in case you don't know, because then Gen 2. Well, the animation explains itself. All right, Palio, this is your last chance to pick up a decent one. Let's see who's on the hiring table today. Taking a look here, we've got three employees ready to get hired, ready for a job to feed their families, buddy. Let's see what you got. Starting on the right here, we've got yourself a wisdom consultant. Wow. 
Wise ones. Yes, yes. Very, very wise. In the middle, you've got a brand ambassador. All right. Interesting. And then on the left, you've got a secret agent. Ah, uh, man, that sounds cool. <laughs> oh, it's a cool table, buddy. It's a cool table. I'll tell you. I'm going to guess the secret agent is the uh, Greninja. Okay. Brand ambassador, I have no clue about. And the wisdom instructor, you said? Yep. Wisdom consultant. You can't instruct wisdom, but you can consult. So what is a, wait, 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 what, what does a wisdom consultant do? Well, it's a person with profound knowledge and insight that could be valuable advisor for an individual or organization seeking guidance on complex issues or strategic planning or decision making. Okay, okay. All in all, a good leader, a leader for hire, if you will. Give me the secret agent right now. I want it. Well, you missed out on a Uxie wisdom consultant. Mm. Very, very profound knowledge and uh, insight. Could be valuable to anyone or any business seeking it. That thing can get trapped by a Team Galactic. I don't think it's that smart. I mean, it's literally meditating right here next to me right now. Like, it's not even looking at me. It's just meditating. Is its eyes closed? Don't worry about that, buddy. Yeah, it probably doesn't see the bad guys coming. Next up, we've got your brand ambassador here. I can't believe you didn't guess this Pikachu? one, buddy. A Charmander, buddy. Uh, Charmander <laughs> is an extremely cool Pokemon. It's uh, adorable yeah. with a rough and tough side and its design you could never forget. Make this Pokemon a part of your brand today. You're sure to succeed. And you got yourself a secret agent what is it? Murkrow. Murkrow no. are small in size and can easily hide in the shadows. No. They're also just crows. Nothing suspicious here. They can gather intel or surveil a target without anyone being the wiser. Secret agent Murkrow added to the team. That's a Haunchcrow. Great Pokemon, actually. One of my favorite. A Haunchcrow is decent, at least. On that table, man, there was good choices. And I'll take Haunchcrow. Dark flying type. That's cool, I guess. Let's go ahead and gather our workforce and uh, put him to work. Let's get into this battle. Okay, chill and play. I hope your workers are ready to work, if you know what I mean. Oh my goodness. Oh, we working. We what working. A start. <clears throat> I see you are what? working as well. Mm-hmm. We're starting off working, you know? That's what we're doing. He's working. If I miss this move, I'm losing my mind. You know Selfie what I mean? time. What? Stealth Stealthy rock time. Mew? That's what right, buddy. What is Sudowoodoo gonna do then? Stealthy time. Oh, you oh, actually where? hit that? We actually, actually, we actually didn't miss. Let's go. He actually Not hit that. Though. Well, let's go ahead and do this. Thunder Wave! Oh, you're just cheese. This is Mew cheesy is just... Mew. This is a cheesy don't Mew. You, don't you Assistant. dare. Yes! Oh, wait. Oh, my. No! Oh, oh, no. Let's go! <laughs> I misread the message, so oh, I debased it myself. Too. Me too. It's. I saw it is paralyzed, so I thought, like, it's said lucky. unable. That was my hazardous Mew. I was going to put spikes out next. Dang. You went full hazard Mew? Yeah, it was something I saw. It was something I saw. I just wanted to do it. I okay. got other things. Don't you worry. Don't you worry about me. the cheese. What is Thrusty going to do, you cheese. ask? You asked what I'm going to do? Uh, now is I that know what you asked, right? Do. Or no? I can't Thrusty's remember. weirdly going to be a problem for me now. Um, uh, just... Am I still faster? Oh, I faster. am still faster. Tell me you're not 30. Tell me you're not 30. Oh, oh he didn't take 30. Let's go. Oh my gosh! What ability did that have? <sighs> Doesn't matter now. I thought if you were paralyzed, we had a chance, mm -hmm, buddy. Mm -hmm. All oh, right, man, then. Oh, man. Well, this is going uh, swimmingly. Uh, Reshi is ramming through right now. He's ramming through right now. We got to do this. I got a better oh, idea. It's okay. No. I only need one homie to do it all. I only need one homie to do it all. Don't you worry. Um, no way I could have one homie do it all actually myself, right? We're gonna start gonna it up with this. Screen! Oh, uh, that's cheesy, but if I don't get paralyzed right here, you're still gonna be in Get paralyzed one time! Whoa! Get paralyzed one time? Oh. Hello? And your spada fell? Uh, okay. Are you gonna get paralyzed <laughs> one time, buddy? Oh my uh, goodness, I'm turbo blazed. Wait, what is this? Full setup team? <laughs> Full setup team, buddy. Full Your setup. Team only Be paralyzed! Size. Why are you never paralyzed? <laughs> Why? You're one and two. I just won it one time. I just paralyzed. half sweeped. Oh no my way, goodness. I just half sweeped. No way, I just half sweeped with Reshi Ram. He stole full HP. He just HP half sweeped with Reshi Ram. We're not oh getting to do everything gosh. we thought we were going to do. This might be the fastest fight we have ever, ever, ever seen. I'm annoyed. Reshi Ram, you are now one of my elite employees. <laughs> Shut your mouth. Surf on him. Oh, oh my gosh. Dude, and you're not paralyzed. This guy. And you're not paralyzed. Oh, I'm tanky. Uh, oh, lefties. buddy. Lefties. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Oh, man, I lost my special attack, though. I shouldn't have done that. 
Like, I literally uh, shouldn't have done that. Yeah, you should have done that. Encore! Do it again! Oh, Do it again! Encore, I Do don't want it again. Anymore. Break a meteor? I guess we never get paralyzed and we never miss. I guess you RNG's never, ever, 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 ever get paralyzed. I must have that Turbo Blaze ability that never lets you get paralyzed. <laughs> is that what that does? Or are you just um, an elite employee? <laughs> this is just an elite <laughs> I don't know which buddy. one, bro. All no! right. No! All right, all right, all right, all right. What are you swapping into? What's the plan here? Tell me this guy just got more cheese moves, please. The plan Crit is to in go your laser. insane. That's Crit the plan. Your laser. The plan Crit is to go absolutely, positively insane. That's the plan. He's going bonkers. He's going bonkers. Is it gonna That's work? It so like. far, no. So far, not so good. What was the plan? I didn't expect uh, you to start with Reshi. That was the plan. Not start with Reshi, and I'm good. Yeah. But now well, we gotta do what we gotta Mew, do. So I figured we were both on the same page. Okay, are there. you seriously not able to get paralyzed, bro? Stop messing with me. Like I need to know. Like this is hurting my feelings right now that you're not telling me. I don't. I don't know. I, don't, I literally don't are know. Are you hiding it from so. me that you can't be paralyzed? And you just think does this turbo is a funny blaze, joke? Does Turbo Blaze have a hidden effect that lets you not get paralyzed? I don't know. I don't I'm know. Me <laughs> me I was just does. I was memeing. I was just memeing, bro. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. All right. Crit. Now we and calm down. Oh no. Now I do need to swap out, actually. Yep. I'm gonna try to do it all oh, with I this guy. Do need to swap out, actually. Is Blue Flare actually physical. Okay, you can't no! move. Never thought I'd see the day. Wow, I actually got paralyzed, Reshiram. I'm about to fire you, bro. Never thought oh, I'd no. see the day. And I'm eating oh, good no. over here, by the way. Yeah, that looks like good eats. That looks like some good eating. Okay, luckily we have other Pokemon, though. You know? There are yeah, other choices. Yeah, luckily. Luckily, luckily, luckily. Oh, I hope luckily. those stones don't hurt my hunch growth. I hope those stones don't hurt oh, my hunch growth. Oh, those stones don't hurt his hunch growth. They don't hurt my hunch growth. They don't hurt his hunch grow. You got boots hurt. on? You got shoes you can't on? See. It, it's got, yeah, it's got those boots right there. It may, you see the claws, but it's wearing boots. Don't worry. We're in trouble, buddy. <laughs> you are in big trouble, buddy. We're in I'm not, trouble, even, I'm not buddy. going easy. I'm not going I'm easy. We're about to we're full almost, sweep you. This, might, this might be the full sweep. We're almost all dead right now. Oh, I know. After all those calm minds, isn't that crazy? We got to just swap yeah, out. Yeah, that is pretty crazy that you swapped out all those calm minds. Frame burn. Frame burn. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh, critical hit. Oh, my God. Oh, oh man. Oh, oh, man. Oh, I'm in pain man. over here. That was worth reflect. Oh, my that goodness. That was worth reflect on. Oh, my goodness. I'm All lasering right. that right you, though. Don't you worry. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm lasering. I'm oh, lasering. He's lasering. <laughs> he's laser. It's over, no by the way. way. It's over. GG, buddy. No, it's not. Is it? I, I can't hurt that crow. Can't hurt that what crow. What else do you have? What else do you have? Is this the last this one? This is it. This is it. You've won. This is your last guy? Why don't I end it with a crit then? Why don't I end it with a super no. crit laser? Actually, I might have one more. You have one more Pokemon? You didn't realize you have one more Pokemon? Oh my gosh, I'm about to I'm about to take myself out. I didn't because he had so low HP, my logo was covering it up, so I didn't see I thought he was dead. That's pretty funny, huh? <laughs> <laughs> GG, um, buddy. That well, was a fun I'm one. I'm sorry, buddy, but it is had a fun one. Fun. Yeah. No way, we got the full quick GG sweep. Shout out quick GG in the comments. Good Thank you, buddy. Start, buddy. Didn't see that coming. Yep, yep. GG. If you guys like that, hit the like button. Let us know who you want to see in a future video. And uh, GG show and play. Fastest fight ever.